It's also a famous magician. Magic Mike. He's not even a magician. <laughs> no, and also that's not a Dickens character. <laughs> Dickens or Disney? The game goes, I give you a quote, mm -hmm. and you say whether it's Dickens or Disney. And right? then I disagree with the answer. I will guess and probably get a lot wrong. This is going to be bad because I like to think of myself as like quite a literary person that knows about books and also a massive fan of Disney. I'm going to do very badly at this. It's going to be embarrassing. Okay, go. You've got to put your behind in the past. Well, that feels vaguely rude. <laughs> that's got to be Disney, surely. I think that's got to be Disney, I'm going to say. That one's easy, that one's uh, Lion King. Pumba. Pumba from The Lion King. A bit cheeky. Dodger, you keep an eye on the new kid. Artful Dodger, so I'm going to go with Dickens and Oliver. Yeah, well, it's Oliver Twist, isn't it? Oliver Twist, Dickens. Well, that's got to be Dickens, obviously, from Oliver Twist. Um, okay, so there we go. Yeah, Disney. Oh no, it's Disney. What? That's Disney? I'm afraid it's Disney. It's... So I win? No, it's not. No. That's, that's rubbish. It's Dickens. Sorry. <laughs> Outrageous! Disney. Ah, oh, Oliver and company. The cat and the dogs and the other things. Doing crime. That's, that's a, a trick, trick question. question! Come on! Okay. Obviously that's Oliver. But that doesn't sound Dickensian to me, so I'm going to go for Disney, because from what I remember, they did like a kind of weird version of that with cats and dogs and stuff. From Oliver and Company. Oliver Twist. Not, not Disney's Oliver Twist. One point to me. I don't know. So small at first, then look how they grow, but someone has to start them. What do you think? Well, I don't know, all right? I okay. don't know. You know what, that immediately I thought, so small at first and look how they go was Disney, but then it got quite poetic. Disney's poetic. Plants, or kids, growing. I don't think Dickens cared that much about plants, so Disney. I've had several Disney in a row, so I'm mm -hmm. gonna stick to my guns and go Dickens. I'm gonna say Dickens. I think it's gotta be Dickens. I'm gonna say that's Dickens. It's Disney again, no! How can, oh, it's Pocahontas. I've never seen Pocahontas. It's not. So the next one's got to be Dickens, surely. I just thought by that point, I was like, well, it has to, by law of averages, be Dickens. And it wasn't, I was tricked. Grandmother Willow, who is that? Okay. Oh, because of Grandmother Willow, that would make sense. I hope the real love and truth are stronger in the end than any evil or misfortune in the world. Dickens. Dickens. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with, because it's just longer, Dickens. That's definitely Dickens. It's Dickens from David Copperfield, but I knew that. No, oh, finally. Congratulations, one point. And do you know where it's from? Bonus point. Merchant of Venice, isn't it? That's Shakespeare. Ah. Oh. But, I'll give you another clue. It was it was made into a film very, very recently. Yeah. By Amando Iannucci. Yes, it was, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. It's also a famous magician. Magic Mike. He's not even a magician. <laughs> no, and also that's not a Dickens character. Famous, famous magician. <laughs> last, last name, first name same as mine. David Copperfield. Yeah, there it is. Isn't it rather dangerous to use one's entirely entire vocabulary in one sentence? I don't have very good vocabulary. That feels Dickensy, doesn't it? One's entire vocabulary in one sentence. I think it might actually be a bit more of an insult, this. Isn't it rather dangerous to use one's entire vocabulary in one sentence? That's sassy. Disney. That's got to be Dickens. I've definitely heard that before, I'm pretty sure. That has to be Dickens. I can't see a Disney character ever saying that. It's Disney! Oh, oh my god! It's Oliver and Company again! Stop it with the Oliver and Company! Dickens is a Dickensian. I see what you guys are doing. I'm livid about this. this these are all these are all just traps. <laughs> I object to this. You've said the answer already. Oliver Twist. No, Oliver and Man. Company. No, it's not Oliver and Company. It's Oliver what? and Company. <laughs> what is Oliver? <laughs> this is outrageous. I will honour Christmas in my heart and try to keep it all the year. I will live in the past, the present, and the future. Right, well obviously, 
we are supposed to think that that is Christmas Carol. Well, that's easy. I've just watched uh, Christmas Carol Goes Wrong. So, Christmas Carol. But, judging by the calibre of the other trick questions in this quiz, I now don't know. That is Dickens, A Christmas Carol. It's got to be Dickens, right? Past, present, I mean, it's got to be Dickens. Yeah, I mean, that is Dickens. Yep, there we go. It's Dickens. I will honour Christmas in my heart and try and keep it all the year. I will live in the past, present and the future. That's what Scrooge says at the end of Christmas Carol. Yes, it's Christmas Carol, Dickens. For God's sake, this is, I, you know, at least we got that one. The final one. I think I've got like two right. It's a weakness to be so affectionate, but I can't help it. Do you know what? I think that might be Dickens. Uh... I think it's Dickens again. But I thought all of them were Dickens. <laughs> That's Dickens. D D D Disney. Great Expectations. Yes, it could be Great ex I'm going to go with Great Expectations. Correct! <laughs> <laughs> it is, yeah. It's Great Expectations. Great Expectations. Expectations. Not met by Greg. I am slightly disappointed in myself, I won't lie. <laughs> oh, what a poor performance. I don't know. Do I get a prize? I don't know. Three points. No, zero points. Three I basically points. gave you that. Three points. 